Welcome and thanks for watching a little video clip um, about our honeymoon or our trip to Australia. After we got married in Seattle, we spent a week in Whitby Island and then made our way back to Australia with a little stop over in New Zealand. And we hope you enjoy um, our pictures and our clips. Shana Klootful here. I'm here in New Zealand at the Mud Pools, where an extensive amount of geothermal activity is present. You'll notice the bubbling, which is about at boiling point, of the mud in this water lake. Shana Klootful here, once again, in an area of New Zealand known as one of the um, largest volcanic areas in the world. Being between the Indian Australian plate and the Pacific plate, it has, it, um, as the two plates meet, it creates a tremendous amount of volcanic and energy activity. Here we're at Artist Palette, um, an area of, that offers many different colors of minerals that come up to the top of the water. When the minerals rise from the water, such as sulfur, carbon, and whatnot, it creates a very colorful color as it cools, such as yellow, green, blue, and we have some orange there in the back. This is quite, truly one of the most amazing areas I have seen yet. I don't think I'd want to take a swim in there, do you? All right, well that's all for now. Back to you, Johannes. Thanks, Shona. Well, that was a rather interesting place, but we also heard about a um, caving system called the White Tomo Caves, and so we made our way over there, got some funky costumes, and made our way into the caves. Go. Hello, this is Sean and Johans again, yet on another New Zealand adventure. Right now, we are at least 300 meters um, underground in a cave where we have a gorgeous body of water that is crystal clear. And the ceiling here, you'll see the bigger um, stalactites, is that how you say it? And then the thinner ones here are straws. So this is, um, well, anyway. So we'll give you a view. tiny space to get here and I got I fell forward in the mud and landed on my face. But anyway, that's all. We're having fun. Well that was our New Zealand adventure and as you can see we had heaps of fun but unfortunately we had to get on the plane and fly back to Australia. And if you stay tuned we got another video clip telling you a little bit more from our trip back to Isa and what we're doing there and yeah thanks for watching